Well, no, not quite site-wide groups, but something new in Moodle known as cohorts, which is a way of enrolling a whole group of users into a course all in one go. I'm going to look at doing this manually and on the front page of my Moodle in the settings block I'm going to scroll down to the site administration area as I am the site administrator and then to users and accounts and cohorts. And this takes me to the cohort setup screen where I press add to set up a new named cohort. So I'm going to give mine a name, the Fab 4, and then you see that I can choose to add this cohort to the site as a whole or a particular category. I have a course category called Distractions which has two courses in it, so I'm going to make my cohort set to there. I'm going to ignore the rest just for speed and save the changes. And then you see that I have the option on the right to edit it, delete it, or assign users to it. When I press assign, then I can select from the ones that I already have in my Moodle and move them into that cohort in the way that you would normally do. So I'm just going to have four users in my cohort. And now you can see that that's set up for me. What I'm going to do now is to go to my online learning course in the distractions course category and in the settings block you can see that it's slightly different now. I need to click on users and then I'm not interested in the enrolled users I'm going to select enrollment methods and when I go to there I see that I already have some options but I'm going to choose cohort sync, cohort synchronization and then it's going to offer me the ones that are available for my distractions category which is only the one of course I can also then choose what role I want them to have. What I see there would be dependent on my role. As I'm administrator, I can see all of them. But I'm going to leave them as students. Then I'm going to press Save Changes. And I've added a cohort to my particular course there. Just out of interest, I've gone to my pie munching course now, which is in the miscellaneous category. And if you remember, we didn't set the cohort for there. So if I, in this course, go to Users and then Enrollment Methods, if I then want to bring in my cohort, I don't actually have that option because there isn't one available. And so that, in just three minutes, is the beginnings of cohorts.